Howdy folks, welcome to episode 11. Last episode in episode 10, Hurley and I went over to the spaceport, as you remember, and we took that out. And afterwards, we kind of played for a while, and one of the things we did was Hurley put in the rest of the garden and got a bunch of stuff picked and everything. So she did some of that. And we also went, if you look on the map here, we went around and we mined like a lot of the a lot of the deposits out. Uh, the one thing we didn't really mine much of is Promethium right now, but we got almost all of the iron and the Promethium and stuff. So there's a lot of that that's almost done, and there's a lot of meteors falling, which we are ignoring, of course. But as you can see here, I've got a ton of this stuff. The Sathium ended up coming out quite a few bars. But yeah, we got a ton of this stuff. I'm making some concrete blocks out of all the dirt and rock dust and all that stuff that we picked up. The rock dust and the water. So it's making those. And we got a total of six power coils out of that deal. And so I made a and the advanced constructor, as you see here. And I also made the pulse rifle. So those are the two things. And so I've only got two power coils left, and I'd like to make some SV rail guns, and they take five power coils each. So I'm going to have to do some more stuff to get some more rail guns, obviously, uh, or at least even to make one. So I know there's four up on the, at least four, I think. Is there two? I think there's two advanced constructors up on the Thermica station if I remember correctly, and somebody mentioned that in the comments that that has, has those on it. And the other thing that somebody mentioned in the comments is that the docking pads now apparently work, so we're going to check that out. And the other thing I got to do on here is get rid of the sidecar. <laughs> So that's where Hurley was riding on when we went around getting all the all of the uh, ores and everything. So I'm going to do that right now. We'll take off these and replace them with the docking pads and see how they look. So we'll get these here and here. And then we'll put the other two on the back. And we'll get those. Let's see, I should put them on the outside instead of on the inside because then the ship doesn't want to roll over okay so that should if that's correct because it used to be that when you put those on they still collided a full block and size and and so when you if you try to do that and park the ship in here it would still sit that's awesome okay excellent so we've now got a little bit more wiggle room in here when we're coming in and I had to take um, I took a light off the bottom too because I'm sure the light would have collided as well but uh, yeah why don't we go see if we can get those power coils and so I'm gonna go up into space here and we'll just head straight up there we go okay so yeah we'll see if we can find the Thermica station and uh, get those power coils today and the other thing I'm going to need to do is I do need to get the rest of that iron in order to there's a drone base over there they're looking at you can see all the POIs now <laughs> but yeah I do need to get the the rest of that iron in order to actually get out of this system because I need to build a CV in order to do that and I've only got like 300 iron ingots which means only 300 blocks and that's not really enough to make <laughs> to make what I need to make for for a CV now let's see if we could find the station the other thing that's new for those of you who haven't played for a while they added you can shift right mouse button and you can eat right out of your inventory you can also use meta kits and if you notice it shows the same thing for the adrenaline shot so you can actually do that now so that's new but yeah, let me find this space station, and I guess, oh, there it is. Okay, I was going to take a break and go look for it, but there it is right there. 
So we'll see if we can take this thing out and let me make sure that I've got my stuff loaded up here. Mini guns loaded and rocket launcher loaded. Excellent. Okay. So we're going to approach this thing and take out the turrets if we can. Or die trying, right? <laughs> Yeah, we'll take out the turrets and see if we can get in there and let's see, what is the range on these rockets? Let's see. Range is, it doesn't show. Okay, nice. I think they were only 400 meters, so I really need to get in pretty fairly close in order to do this. And I don't want to be on the side where I've got, got the sun in my face. So yeah, we'll see what they've... Whoa, there they are. There's the turrets. So if we approach from one side, we should be able to take out just the ones on one side at a time and not have all of them shooting at us. So why don't we come at a straight angle here and see if we can find them. Because I don't see them yet. Is that, is that one right there? Yeah, it is. Let's see, what just happened there? Are they hitting? They're not hitting at 300 meters, really? What is the range on my rockets? What is the range on my rockets that I can't hit at 300 meters? Seriously? Okay. Uh, and... Ah! <laughs> Dodge! Dodge! Oh man, he's shooting a lot. There's one. Did, it, did we get him? I think we got him. Yep. Okay, well, it looks like, it looks like we just, and let me see, let me make sure that thing isn't, okay, the space drone isn't close enough to come after us. So, I think if I just sit the ship here, it should be safe. So let's put on our helmet. I actually remembered that. And turn on the jetpack and get out of the ship. Yeah, so now I didn't actually go flying when I get out of the ship. Okay, so let's see if we can get in here. Where is the entrance? And hopefully I can do that without <laughs> running in front of one of the uh, turrets here. Let's see if there's an entrance. Is there an entrance? Is it down here? Where's the entrance? I think there's a turret right underneath me too. This is crazy. That's <laughs> probably not a smart idea what I'm doing, but... Yeah, is that a turret? Yeah, I'm seeing... Yeah, okay, you can see it right there. You can see that little red spot. That's a turret there. So, um, let's see. Do I have something that will get through this? Yeah. Let's try this. Oh, and I only had one shot left. Okay. <laughs> nice. And I don't think these will actually go through. Or is that just the armor block? Yeah, I guess they will. Huh. Okay, let's try this. Yep, we can get in here. Okay, good, good. This is not the new, uh, oh, cool, there you go. <laughs> well, that was easy. <laughs> so yeah, those are not the new, um, whatchamacallits that you can't, um, that you can't get through with the guns. The new armored plates you can't shoot out with guns, but the old, the old builds did not use those, obviously. So we're going to do this because, and that's one of the other things I'm going to need to do is I'll probably just go through um, the POI that we took out and actually go through with the repair and remove and remove all the blocks because, um, because we need all the iron we can get from the planet. And I mean, honestly, I can just go to the moon and mine out a bunch of the moon as well, but I figure that would probably be an easy source of iron and it would probably be about equivalent to mining out. So, wow, why did I hit reload? I hate when I do that. Okay, so we're going to set the ship in here just to give me a little bit more of a sense of security in here. And I'm hoping that the plasma drone or space drone or whatever it is, plasma drone, laser drone, does not <laughs> come after us. But yeah, let's, uh, let's turn this thing off and let's see what we can find in here. I should have brought a core. Um, yeah, is this an elevator? Okay, so there is stuff in here. 
Let's see. And there's no gravity either, so we get to do this the fun way. We must be at the top. Okay, so we'll go down. And I hate that you bump into stuff and you just go bonk. <laughs> you spin all over the place every time you run into something. Okay. And here we go. Here's at the bottom. That's where the space drone comes in, right? When we're when we're uh, <laughs> too far away to do anything. Oh, and apparently we're upside down. Okay. That's cool. Okay, so we're parked at the bottom of the station, not the top. And here are oxygen and stuff. Is that to the outside? That's the outside. Okay. And we'll get some... Let's see... We'll check the other side here, which I'm sure is just the same. Okay, and is there another door here, or does this go... Does this have power coils in it? It has flux coils. Oh man. I was hoping that was power coils. Okay, so we keep going down. <laughs> down or up or whatever it is. Okay, why don't I turn around here so we're... Okay, so the, the ship is up above us. And let's see, we have... Ooh, we have garden plots. I can take those. I can take a bunch of those. That's cool. That'll save me some work on getting the... Whatchamacallits? The uh, spoiled food. Which you can get from attacking the plant monsters, but it's not quite as quick because you have to go find the plant monsters to do it okay and let's see what else i will probably finish out stripping this whole thing here's some cargo boxes let's see i don't think there's anything in those but yeah i can finish stripping this out off camera later instead of making you guys watch this but we'll see here we go is this advanced constructor and event yeah there's two advanced constructors Okay, there's one, <laughs> and that's where I run out of ammo. That's nice. Okay, there we go. Awesome. Okay, we have that, and I should probably get out of here. And like I said, I can come back and clean this out later. kind of curious what's down here, though. And let's see. What else is there? There's more. Oh, that's, that's where I came from. Okay. Well, we'll get out of here if we can. If we can. There. <laughs> and there's my ship. Okay, so I'm going to head back to the planet. And I think we're going to take out some more of the, the turrets on the planet. Now that I actually have enough to make a railgun, I want to try doing that with a single railgun and see how it does. So I will meet you guys with the upgrade in a minute. Like a glove. Okay, guys, we're back, and as you can see here, I've got the railgun added on. I threw ammo in the ammo box, and I also repainted a little on the ship, make it a little more presentable, since we've actually been continuing to use it. I didn't actually plan to keep using this ship for so long, but now we are, so um, I will build a new one when we decide to move out of that base but I don't want to build something bigger that won't fit into that base so let's go try out the rail guns and we'll see if we can take out some of these POI turrets because eventually uh, Hurley and I are going to do raids or I'll do raids by myself or whatever but I want them to be actually not shooting at me as I'm wandering around and yeah I need to reload so we'll get this reloaded and see how this thing does see if it hits yeah it hits it doesn't it doesn't sh it doesn't one shot it which really sucks but it takes what three so far oh man that's a lot of turrets on that thing four whoa that was close that was really close <laughs> that's four so far five yeah, this is horrible. Okay, I guess I won't be using the rail guns. Cause ah! <laughs> Let's get back out of range. Get them to stop shooting, and then they'll start shooting all at the same time again, and then it's easy to dodge. 
that's pretty scary right there. Okay, let's go now. Six shots? Yeah, that's crazy. I don't know how many shots it's going to take, but it's too many. Let's see. Let's keep going, and I'll end up using the rockets anyway once I get seven, eight, nine. Wow. They must have either I'm missing and I'm just not seeing it, or they've increased the hit points on a turrets or something. Because, yeah, okay, that's that's I'm going to get killed trying to do that, so I'm just going to use the rockets instead of this. Okay, there we go. There's one. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Get out, get out, get out. <laughs> get out. Get out, get out, get out, get out. Okay. <laughs> Let's get out of range so I can see where I took damage here. There's the troop transport. <laughs> Not that we can actually kill the troop transport, because where is he even going? It's a weird place to land. Okay, so let's level out here, and let's see what, where we took damage. Gatling gun, rail gun, nice, we took damage in the front. Okay. Alright, um, yeah, let's get the rest of these turrets out. And then we'll see what we've got after that. Let's see, is there an easier approach to this thing? Or I'm not getting blown up every three seconds. Come on. Back. Something's... Oh, they're shooting each other. Okay, they're shooting themselves. <laughs> they're still doing that. Okay. I'm fine with that. I'm okay with that. Get rid of this guy, too. There we go. There's that. And... Basically, you don't want to keep moving in a straight line because they do properly lead you. And uh, whoa! So if you keep dodging in the same, in the same, if you keep going in the same direction and don't keep switching directions, they will hit you. So let's see if there's an easier approach here. There we go. There's one. And let's see if we can sit in the where. We can go where there's either only one shooting at us or they're shooting at each. Whoa! I see they're they're. Oh, he's shooting the ground. <laughs> they're firing at where I would be if I kept going in a straight line, and that includes if <laughs> apparently underneath the ground. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> so let's get the last of these turrets. Hopefully that's the last one. And. There we go. Nope. Didn't get him. There we go. Okay. And no, still didn't kill him. I think they increased the hit points on the turrets or something. Because even the rockets don't seem to be taking them out quite as easily. Is that another turret right there? I think it is. Is that a turret? It looks like it. Why is it not dying? Die already, turret. There we go. Okay, so I think that's all the turrets. And let me go loot this drone, too, while I'm at it. And so I'm going to go around and get the rest of the planet like this. And I think that's going to be it for episode 11. So I'm going to, between episodes, I'm going to do all the uh, not interesting to watch stuff, like finishing off these turrets and doing the other two iron deposits and probably finish off the rest of the mineral deposits on this planet and so we can hopefully start on a cv build soon in the next episode or so so we will see you in episode 12 later